In this town near the stricken Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant, workers struggling to bring the crisis under control have replaced tourists. With thousands of workers being called up, hotels and laundromats are filled with those who head into the nuclear exclusion zone. But as radiation fears run high, many workers still deny the dangers posed by working in high radiation environments. One 36-year-old electrician from northern Japan, who asked to remain anonymous, insists that life isn't as dangerous as the media makes it out to be. The job itself isn't as dangerous as people assume. While it's dangerous, I don't think it's that dangerous. At least eight workers have been exposed to higher than legal levels of radiation. Even so, the worker says that while conditions aren't ideal, most feel the work simply needs to get done. I think there are very few people working there who don't want to. I'm often asked whether I'm okay with working in such a dangerous environment. But if no one does it, nothing will ever get done, right? The Fukushima crisis was triggered by an earthquake and tsunami that struck northeastern Japan in March. It's the world's worst nuclear disaster since the 1986 Chernobyl accident in Ukraine. Travis Brecker, Reuters.